tell me who. Okay. Well, that this is an apple tree, and at the beginning of the season, he was looking just like a branch. Not no leaves, no flowers, no nothing, because the grasshopper was munching on it. Right there, some kind of mite that was putting um, uh, netting around the thing. And since we went to a few classes, and they said that it wasn't good to put insecticides and stuff, because some insects are good for it, so you don't want to kill the good insects thinking that you're killing the bad insects. So we just spray it with water, and at one point we catch the house grasshopper and just release it to the other side of the fence. Uh -huh. And you can go munch and wild stuff rather than this apple tree. Okay. And after that, we spray it with water again a couple of times, and it's looking good. It has leaves almost everywhere. Well, and I... We still have some more leaves growing. I have to tell you that I... You know, this is probably the best that I've seen it in, uh, in ever. You know, that since we've been here about well, seven or eight years. Well, when we brought it, he had flowers, but never developed fruit. So we never seen fruit on him. But he is um, very cherry. He's cherry with a butterfly right there. Oh, wow. That's yeah. a butterfly, huh? He likes to cherry with butterflies. And also, when I put down some marigolds, so because that, marigolds are beneficial. That right there is a butterfly? Yeah. I don't butterfly know if it's... Nest? Oh. If it's a moth or a butterfly, but it is a cocoon. cocoon. Yeah. That's cool. And that's a, what is it? A marigold. And marigolds are good because they give stuff to the tree and they also keep away um, insects that are not good. So when I was putting those down, he has a lot of worms in his dirt.